Welcome back everybody. Farming Simulator 17. Here on Chanelton's Farms. Mr. Blue Farms. Your host with uh, not the most. Folks, we're uh, at it pretty tough this morning. Well, not morning here. Morning for me in real life, but uh, I guess you can say early evening in the game life. All that didn't hit the water. But we are trying to get a load of trees. Since we're kind of stalling time to, well not stalling time, need to speed up time. So we plant some sunflowers. Still waiting on that. Actually, matter of fact, you know, I am going to increase time by 15. Maybe we'll get to plant some today. Uh, I am trying to clear out some of these trees here. Um, what we're doing, in case y'all missed the last episode, or first, folks, how y'all doing, by the way? Y'all doing all right? Oh, I knew it was going to do that. Oh, well. Uh, what we are doing here, as you can see, we're cutting trees. No doubt about that, huh? Well, the, bo the boss man came down and said that you know, hey, we, oh, wrong way, wrong way, catch it, catch it, catch it, you know, it's still going to fall, oh, so there's one big tree, but the boss man came down and said he wanted the, the trees around this roadway cleared out, so it'd be a little bit safer on the guys going and cutting the logs up, up north, or is it up north? Um, yeah, yeah, we're up north, northwest we was at, and, um, but anyway, I said, yeah, we, we can take our scorpion from the sawmill and, and come up here and cut some for them. You know, we're making uh, some money here on the side, and all the trees are going to us, so we got all that money. It's about 23 to 2,500 per eight mil, eight meters that is, except for these little ones, oh well, you gotta take the good with the bad, right, there we go, they won't get much for it, so, but uh, he, he just wants us to leave every other one on that side, Let's see here, let's go ahead and get this in right here. So yeah, uh, I figured uh make another episode of log work. Kinda pass the time off here a little bit. But uh we we gotta go furnish our other place. It's getting low on logs, so I'm take a couple loads up that way. Let's see if I can get some more money out of this in here. But uh, we we need to buy some animals and test them out again. Um, having problems. I think I loaded this map wrong. I've been going back looking, and it says in Stevie's thing there to delete all the wool out of the cell point before you start a new map with season mods and I don't think I did that alright let's see uh, this and, and that and the take out and I'll go on down that way but uh, before I take these out I'm just going to switch this off we're going to walk around here and get our semi truck and load up some of these logs because I don't want them rolling on anybody if anybody comes down through here. Uh, Kentucky farmer truck here. But uh, the log, logger, log, logging trailers. And yes, folks, this truck does have power. I got to souped up and over it. Now I'm going to turn our little gray box on that I hate. I switch to the other side and then hit B. Uh, 
looks like I'm too close. This tends to work better when I'm a little bit away from it. See what's wrong here. At least, ah, I see. Ah, come on. Why ain't I getting that? One? That might be a. See if I can try to squeeze some of these over. Why are we not all... Oh my god, what happened? I cut them in 8 mil. Oh, I'm on the wrong one. Okay. That's why. Now I get up. Maybe wrong side. Let's try that again. There we go. Some of them's going in now. I was wondering what was wrong there. And why ain't those picking up? There we go. Alright, grab that. Uh, sometimes they're kind of picky. Let's see what's wrong with this one. Sometimes they'll have branches on them. But that in there, it should... The uh, autoload box needs to be down a little bit more, I believe. Because it's not wanting to reach down. I might not have enough logs put yet the way it looks. I was hoping I did. Oh Lord, here we go again. Alright, I still got on the auto load to see. Surely I don't have to move all of these. what it was I had to move them. there we go yeah, I almost got it yeah, a little bit more we can do a little bit more can't we we don't get hung up on some of these rocks Oh look, see it's going to take all of them. And I think I got that, yep, that trailer's loaded, so it'll stop all the load. We're going to strap her down. And we're going to switch to the back trailer. And I do have some right there. I think go in. It looks like we're going to have to cut some more. Let me shut this truck off. And this, hopefully this will be a, a short episode of log cutting. Um, I know y'all probably don't like seeing it, but some of y'all do, some don't. Let's see, 8 mil. Yep, 8 mil. Uh, so, have to take the good with the bad, you know. For some of y'all it's going to be good, others going to be bad. And then those that's bad, it's going to be good, and you know, ones good, it's going to be bad. Uh, depend on just what we're doing. Uh, this is just to help us out and let's make some extra money out there in the harvest. You know, unlike No Creek Farms, we don't have no way to make money on there except for, I think what I'm doing now is bailing. 
and uh, hopefully they'll make make you some money on there. I didn't think it's down for now. I tried to leave about maybe a foot or two. But I don't know about this map. I'm going to give it animals one more try and see how that does. I know sheep's are a little bit more time consuming now on seasons instead of what it was. I don't know if I can get this big boy to land this right, but I'm going to try to get him to land on the road. Might turn him that way. He should fall. Hopefully just right. Yep, on the road. Twist him around. Alright, I think we saved that and I helped load these trucks a little bit faster. Now I'm hoping there's a place we can turn around up here. Instead of having to go all the way around this mountain. That's a long drive, folks. And, uh, we got quite a few there, don't we? Ah, uh, come on, auto save. There we go. I'm gonna get this big boy right here get the same way. Try to make it fall on the road and pull him back. We, we can make money just by dropping them in the water right here, but. I want to do that with the smaller ones. Cause I really need to take a load down to the other sawmill where they make the cargo pallets and stuff like that. Crates and I like using the mountain there. Kind of get oh no oh no. That cut one to oh that train. That train likes coming by when I'm recording for some reason. Let's see, that looks like another tall one. We'll do the same for it. The reason why, I'm, you know, the other sawmill is getting low on trees. And that's my money maker when I'm fast forward time, for real. Uh, which is still making the same money. It's just. I can speed up time, it gets it faster and so. stuff. I'm not worried about the ones that got the limbs on or the branches on them right now. Uh, we can come in, all load, and they'll pick up the ones around it. Then we'll cut them. Now that might be enough. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna pull this guy up out of the way so we can get past him. That should work. Our motor off. Get it out of the bushes. Ow, ow, that hurt. Uh, here's these logs. I don't know. Maybe we can. Ah, come on now. Alright, start a motor back up. I'm on a... Uh, we are on the right side. We need to be on the left side for a second. Don't want to get hung up on these rocks either. Alright, it's all load. See, uh, Might have to help it out here. Might be down too low. Uh, huh. Oh man, I'm throwing them in the water. Oh. Well. Okay, I, I take it they didn't want on the truck, but uh, that'll work too. Alright, chain sides. <coughs> Excuse me, folks. I think I'm catching a cold. Coughing quite a bit. 
A lot of times you gotta look because your uh, auto load will stop on you after it loads a couple. And you have to hit the button again. I always like to turn it off. Oh, it's getting dark now. Let's go ahead and load up what we can and then we'll uh, head back on over to the house. And I want to show y'all something that I put in the game. I'm going to leave that on auto load. Oh, oh, oh. Get out here and I'm on. Yeah. Yeah, I think my auto load just went off. Yep. And there we go. Alright, that's not really quite a load, but I don't want too much weight. So, let's see if we can find us a place to turn around. It's going to be hard with double trailers. And you see how hard it is to see up through here. Oh, I think I'm going to have to... Go all the way up and around. Right, let me get my little gray box off here and get this off. I can pull this up. Folks, I guess I'm just going to have to go all the way around. A little rough going over these rocks. But, about the only way out of here with double trailers. Or even a single trailer at that matter is so tight. Whoa, whoa, don't hit no trees. I gotta take it really slow because this truck here will. It's got the horsepower to get on up and around before I even know it. But we get up in here, we can really hurt a forest with all these trees, taking them out. Wish we could load those. But I'm up here at the top now, as you won't be able to see, because the little RB button, and you can start seeing me now on the map, top, top left corner. And yeah, we got a demand for wool, in which we ain't, we don't have any. It's a pretty neat place right here. Um, really oversee the the land right here all these trees folks oh my god I forgot to strap a trailer down there we go glad I noticed that before we got going too fast you can see I'm still getting a harvest income 10,615 over on the right side that's from the pallets folks pallets of wood that all these logs I'm taking and dropping off, they make pallets and other stuff. Gotta go slow on these hills going down. Sure don't want to wreck. Alright, we are back here. And I got another load right over there we're going to get up to. That'll leave us with a spare trailer. I just hope I can do this. Oh, quite a bit there. Almost there. Can I get it on this one? No, oh, not quite. Uh oh, pushing the trailer there. Uh 
Come on, give me the sign. Good luck. Come on. Oh, it's way on back here. Okay. Aha! We got three loads now, folks. Let's see if we can see this. Yep, it's locked. Okay, so we're good to go now. Alright, uh. From where we're at, we're gonna drive all the way across over to Barnes. So let's get busy, because it's getting late. Might have to wait and take this in the morning. I'll tell you what, that's what I'm going to do. I should be able to fast forward night by now. Yep, there we go. I'm going to shut this off, shut the lights off. I'm just going to sleep in the, one of these houses over here. Yeah, I need to take this truck back too. Wow, started up and jumped out. Let me take this under the wood chips real fast and we'll skip night. And I'll just sleep in this truck. So they're going all the way back to my house to sleep and uh, all right. uh oh no this thing's out of logs yep this thing's out of logs now and him wow okay anyway i'm gonna skip night here and i'll see y'all in the morning yeah, Don's 412. Let's go ahead and go to 6. I'm tired. I need some rest, so. <laughs> Whoa, morning came fast. Wow, I didn't even have time to track a stuff my coke here. All right, we got vehicle running costs is 3496 property maintenance. And we got property income of 5386 So our property income helped us out. And of course our harvest income. But um, we got to get busy. We got to get this truck here on the road over to the oven. And then we got to come back here and fill these. Let's check these out real quick before I leave. Um, oh no, we're out of fuel. We are out of fuel there. That's not good. So that plant shut down. Um, logs are zero on this, and oh my, this, I forgot, let's stop time, let's stop time, so that needs logs, and this one's out of logs, oh man, all of them are out of logs, all right, well, we gotta get going. But I, if I'm not mistaken, we are going to have to, uh, be cutting logs quite a bit since they're down low. But it's only because I've been fast forwarding time, because uh, time's been going faster than I could cut trees, so. And here I am hogging the road car there in front of me and oh car coming so I better get over oh barely missed them All right, I'm gonna see if I can pass this car we're in a hurry to get things done and I don't know why oh yeah perfect oh just in time right, I'm trying to Oh yeah, we're going the right way. Oh, I'm going to slow down. Got another car in front of me. Come on, OJ. Look like a white Bronco of his. Where is it? Yep, it's a white Bronco. I'll pull my map back up. Our turn's coming up here in a minute. Come on. 
Get out of the way. Busy farmer coming through. I love the horn on this truck. Be looking out the window like, where's the train at? Turn first curve here. Uh, yeah, we do. Yeah. We take this bridge right here. Ooh. Ooh. Can we make it? Three trailers. Might see the weight limit there. I hope not. Oh, yeah, we made it. All right, we need to take some of these trees out so we can see too. All right, there's our uh, wood chipper thing there. Seems like this is still running, yeah. Let's see where we're at here. Wow, 23,000 left. Huh. What a, what a perfect timing. I was wondering where the income was still coming in at. Alright, let's see if we can get these unloaded. Oh, wow, okay. That was easy. Um, I need to change that to the left side, and I need to hit X. Yeah, it's full. Wow, really? Uh, 150,000 probably. 149. The pro hose 150,000. Oh, we got some extra logs there. Um, probably gonna have to get a front loader for up here. So I'm just gonna drop these logs. Let's see here. I need to circle around. Drop them right over there. Let me see if I can jackknife a little bit and get it back over to here. I just hope this don't make us game laggy. But we're going to drop all our logs right here on the right side of this place. So switching the trailer to unstrapping X to unload. Switch to the back one, unstrap it, and then X to unload. I still ain't good on. Oh, 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 stop. Swap sides. X to unload on that side. And I'm gonna swap sides and hit B. Oh, come on, don't do one at a time. Now, go ahead and pick some of them back up. Guess it's all it's going to pick up. Okay, swap signs. X. Because I want them all on that side there. Alright, I'm going to pull up. And hopefully, they'll stay right. Alright, good. Alright, let's check on our uh, plant. Why well, it's shown we should be able to plant sunflowers, but our temperature is not right. It needs to be in blue. Um, I'm assuming anyway. Uh, sunflowers 45 degrees what it calls for and we're at 45 degrees I'm gonna fast forward time just a little bit till the sun comes up 
you know, probably about eight o'clock. I'll worry about getting this bad boy back here in a minute. Let's go ahead and swap over to our tractor here. We are set on sunflowers and I think I'm gonna plant like go down this way, plant down that way, back across that end. Oh look or crops are coming up back here let's go look at them real quick while we're waiting on the time some more and uh, so this is corn and this is sugar beets but our corn is looking looking yellowish to me like it's not really all right, so I forgot to show you all that. Let's go back to our house over here. And, uh, oh, the lag is real. The lag is real. That's why I kind of keep my head down when I'm walking, because sometimes you look at the house and it, see how it just picked up speed. And now it's kind of stall. Folks, this is a, a like a lighthouse yard decoration but your eggs you can put this next to your chicken coop and it will automatically pick up your eggs for you and put them in your backpack but where, where's the I think I passed it this in here I already had one and I forgot about it uh, the eggs automatically spawn right here but but with this thing here, you don't have to worry about it because it automatically put the eggs in your backpack. So let's check it out. Eggs and backpack is 14. So we don't have to worry about picking up the eggs. We, yes, you can see we actually have a maid to put the eggs in the backpack for us. So, and of course we don't have no animals. We sold them all. Uh, uh, yeah, but that's pretty much it on the chickens. Uh, we can probably plant now, but um, temperature still hasn't changed. Let's just fast forward time just a little bit more. Um, get over here to our egg collector. Uh, I just want to see if it pop up any while we're standing here. Um, sun is up. As you can see, our temperatures 52 and 49. Or is that 45? Uh, probably 45. 52 and 45. I always like to go to the, like, the second day. So, I guess, folks, when we come back, we'll, we'll be uh, planting sunflowers. Which I probably could go ahead and, let's see, four, five, six, seven, go four days ahead, uh, like to the eighth day, and that'll still give me time to plant sunflowers. And the soybeans and corn will be ready. So I might just do that. Because um, we won't be making no money. Because all the factories are out of wood. The only one to be working will be that one. But that should be okay. So I'll probably uh, go ahead and run that truck back while we're waiting. But next time y'all come in, folks, I'm going to have it ready where we can plant sunflowers, corn, and beans. And uh, I like to see what the outcome of corn is going to be. Because that feels, a, you know, a filled corn and it's not ready for it. So it might be withered. I hope not, but 
you know how those things go. Let's see, we're still on nine Fahrenheit on everything on. Um, right now it's showing wheat as the highest price to plant. I mean to uh, sell and and canola. I mean barley. Sunflowers would be on this day. Soybeans in midsummer looks like. Uh, corn potatoes. Just kind of getting a rough estimate. Uh, Fertilize. Next day. Manure if we had it. Digest eight. Okay. Well, anyway, so I'm probably gonna go sell for great demand for at meals for total mixed rations. Oh, I didn't know that. All right. Well, we can skip day or skip night, I should say. So let's go ahead and let's go ahead and go to six. But folks, I'm gonna leave it right there. I'm gonna fix it. Well, the next episode we'll be planting. Sunflowers and corn and stuff. Oh. Vehicle running costs ain't that bad. All right. Well, y'all have a great day, folks. A blessed day. And thank you for stopping by, watching me and stuff. And I really appreciate all the support and the love y'all been giving me on comments and stuff. So don't forget to leave a comment. Hit that like button on your way out. And if you're new, don't forget to subscribe. And I will see y'all tomorrow, folks. Bye.